What do you feel about the backlash that Beyonce is getting from the uh, Black Panther uh, oh, thing she did like when she was uh, performing? Oh, I mean, I think in, in being famous, there's ups and downs no matter what. You know, I think when you're really famous for a second and everyone loves you, you have to expect that in a quick couple of moments, everyone's going to turn on you. And then it'll go back and forth. One minute they hate you, the next minute they love you. It's all part of, of being in front of the camera all the time. And having an opinion. Yeah, and having some kind so, of So, like, if you have a strong point of view... Statements. Everybody's going to have an opinion about so, yeah. your opinion. So, so, what you have to understand is backlash to certain people isn't what the opinion is. Right. It's the fact that people are talking about you as the win. Exactly. You understand what I'm saying? Whether they're talking about you bad or talking about you good, a publicity stunt isn't about opinion within the publicity stunt or what people say. It's the fact that people are acknowledging you. That's the win. They're calling her racist because they're calling her. Yeah. You understand what I'm saying? Like regardless of what they're they saying, call her, her name. Her name has her been name repeated is ringing so bells. She's hot. Times. She's hot right now. And that's what Damon was saying to Stacy. Here's a, her name is hot right now. You're hot. You're hot for this shit. For saying bad things or things that black people took wrong. It's made you the hottest you've ever been. You know like regardless saying? of what it is, people are in the end they're, they're gonna they're gonna just matter. know that name because of something. Look at Donald, like I I remember Donald Trump that. says the worst shit in the world and it just makes him hotter. It yes. goes up in the polls every time he says some crazy shit. Everybody that's knows the world, who Donald Trump. That's the world we live in right now. Every so single if, person. So if your win is celebrity, then it doesn't matter. You know, but I really didn't, I didn't know about any backlash or I didn't know about any, you know, me, I'm in my own little bubble. I should be definitely like not looking at what yeah. Beyonce's doing. Well, you know her pants were dressed like Black Panthers, as she said. I'm she she do that all She was just acknowledging the history, Black history. Like I said, man, if she feels like doing something she can do it, people feel like talking about it, whether it's bad or good, then she's still relevant. And, and that's all that really counts to me. Now, if you're, uh, have a false sense of self and you're insecure, You'll give a fuck what people say. Exactly. But me being a person that doesn't give a flying fuck what people say, as long as I'm being honest, then I, I would only have to say if she doesn't. What's that? Flying. 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 But, um, yeah, you know, so if she cares, then, yeah, it's going to bother. If she doesn't care, then she won. You know, caring is where it becomes, to me, yeah. whether or not you lose a win. Like, you care what other people think. Who gives a fuck what other people think? Especially if they haven't done what you've done. Who has the guts to go on a Super Bowl in front of the, all these people and even have make any kind of statement at all? There's a win in having courage. So the fact that she did something different, you know, that she remains fearless about, you know, what people think by getting in front of them, you know, there's always a win in that to me. Yeah. If you really care about what people that don't do as much as you think, then you're always going to be kind of in a bad place. The Super Bowl is like the biggest platform. Yeah, she there won. Is. She, she I, won. I don't give a fuck what I did at the Super Bowl. <laughs> I was, I performed at the Super Bowl. Could you perform at the Super Bowl? Exactly. It was like well, could you have got, got snatched yeah. a little bit. You know? Could you have an opinion on what you? What, could someone have an opinion on what you did at the Super Bowl? Not at all. All right. So there's the win. The fact that right. anyone can have an opinion. You know, that's what I say about the Kanye, whether they say his clothes are dope or not. The nigga showcased his shit at the garden. And sold it out. And sold it out. That's a win within itself. That's never been done in hip hop before. There's a win right there. Fuck what the clothes look like. You know what I'm saying? Or someone's opinion of the clothes. There was, mm -hmm. He just popped some pop. You know, but if he cares what everyone thinks, then yeah, he's going to end up pretty sad. Because once you give someone like a lane, a platform to speak without repercussion, where they can get, like, you know, someone can say something that bad about them, you know, it, it, once you give them that platform, it, it's like dangerous. That anyone's gonna say something. You're gonna hear it from anybody. Because there's no repercussion of it. You know what I mean? There's no backlash. You can say whatever you want. Now, why would I care about someone that has nothing to lose when he says something? Right. He doesn't even give a bit of himself. He's just focusing on my game and we can't talk about his. Right. How do you care about that person in their opinion? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Especially when your shit is selling out. <laughs> Selling out. You, you sold your shit, you know, the garden's packed, everyone made money or whatever, and covered his course. Everybody's you know. taking pictures, everybody's Instagramming, everybody's yeah, everyone's everybody's everybody's That's what he wants, about, everyone to say his name, and that's what he got. Mm -hmm. And I'm good, because he's actually on the uh, executive producer of Toronto, so exactly. I, I love it. 